Hello everyone, I am Defush3004. Welcome back to Grounded. As you can see, I'm in the middle of a battle. I have a wolf spider here, and I'm actually doing pretty good against him. I've already died once. And Oh boy. He was running around here. I had got a larva. And I have him right here. And I got his acid gland. Now I got the fangs and the venom. So he was just wandering around. And I just happened to see him. I heard something. And I thought for sure it was going to be one of the little guys that we can cook up. And it turns out that it was not. It was a wolf spider. So I was happy for the spider. To, not really happy for him. But happy that I was able to be in a good spot to get him. He did hit me once, as I said, and I died, so I spawned right back at this place. I didn't spawn all the way across the map like last time. I really don't know what happened last time and why I spawned so far away, but I did. But we got one, so that's the important part. And that's the part that I am the most excited about. Here. It's always good to get extra stuff, you know, when you can get the extra things that you need so much. That's always going to be good. All right. Last time that we were here, we were, uh, you know, planning on making a base, but then we decided to set up a drying rack here. So we have this going, and now I need to go up top. And I'm going to scan the fangs and try to get that stuff done so I have that in their, my belt. Excuse me, then we can be done with that. Now there is that guy. Where is he at? I hear he. Ah, he's in this rock here. Okay. He's, wait, wait. No, there he is. Okay, cool. Got him. More food. Thought he was in the rock, but he was not. Just thought so. Hearing other stuff out here, but I don't know if there is anything else out here. I was really surprised to see a wolfie running around because it's only 4.57, 5 o'clock. That was kind of surprising. And it didn't take too long to take him out with this bow. I do got to say, that was pretty doggone impressive. I was liking that a lot. All right. Well, looks like we can finally analyze these now. So let's go ahead and analyze them. Sweet. Good. So now we have that. Getting closer to our next level of brain power. That's good. Sweet. All right, now that that's done and we got ourselves in a wolf spider and second one, this time I actually got the fangs done and oh, that's good. That's always good. So many berries around here, but we can only use so many. I was just completely shocked by the spider around here. I didn't expect him to be here. Just got the heebie-jeebies from the spider right now. Big old convulsion going through me from them. I don't like spiders, as you think you are well aware of all my icky comments and all that stuff. I'm not a spider fan, but I'm trying to get over that fear, and it's hard to do. All right, I am waiting for these to dry, and I'm going to get that done. How many ladybug parts do we have? I actually need to go see here. Let's go ahead and open this up. We have nine ladybug parts. That's all that we have left. And that's not the best, but I guess it's better than nothing. Good, 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 good. We got some. We didn't get any spider parts, but I'm okay with that because at least we got the fangs, and that's the most important part. I think I am going to drop that, and let's go and put those in there. I do not want to lose those. Those are very important. Can't make another bow without those. 
All right, let's go see about cooking up our wee weevil. I was going to say weasel, but knew that was not right. Okay, get that done, and I'm going to wait for these to dry and probably cook up quite a bit more, dry up quite a bit more of those. And in the meantime, we might go out and do a couple of other things, and I'll show you that in a little bit. Keep on hearing things. I don't know what it is. Um, I would like to see if we can go out and... Ooh, that's getting damaged. We need more ladybug parts. And we need more of the dried berries. So, so we're going to have to repair this stuff. We're going to have to keep it repaired if we're going to make any headway. And I'd like to see about trying to find that science that's over there where that hit that head is for the doll part that the hoops was talking about all right and I want to go over and see if we can get to that doggone battery we'll probably do that in the morning it is already starting to be what 6 5 30 and it's gonna be getting dark here soon as you can tell looking out this way once we come out here it's not too terribly bad but it's still going to be a bit of a tough thing to you know keep our stuff up I'm gonna wait for all of that stuff to dry and we'll get that going refreshed. okay got water let's have a bite of food Now we're feeling pretty good. I guess I should probably gather up a few more of these because I want to make another basket. Let's go see what a basket takes because I don't remember. You'd think after doing this so many times that I would remember, but apparently I'm not very good at remembering. Now a chest would be great, but we don't have any acorns and we can get sap. Just the acorns is the one problem. So I guess we'll have to do, okay, we need clover leaves and crude rope. This would be good. This would probably be the best, but trying to find the acorns around here is going to be a bit of a problem, so I'm not going to get too worried about that. Let's, uh, see, we need, where in the heck, are they? there they are. Let's go get some of these, and then we'll make another basket and store some more stuff in there. Okay, for the basket we just need some ropes and how much room do we have in our inventory we do have plenty of room i'm going to gather up all of that stuff for the ropes and i'll make quite a bit of that maybe make a couple of baskets and start storing stuff and then we will see about going over to where the other ones are the orb weavers see if we can look at that battery figure out what to do with that maybe even take out a couple of them get a good night's sleep in the process and hope that we can do okay because that's kind of the big thing right now is trying to make sure that we do okay let me get that done and I'll come back and we'll see if we have the jerky stuff dried or not and we will continue on our way and hope to get quite a bit more stuff done I will see you in the morning all right, I got myself mostly full of water. It is the next day, so good morning to you. And I've already been out scavenging for water and whatever else I could find. I didn't really find any, so I had to use my canteen. <coughs> Excuse me. But I didn't have any bad encounters overnight either, so that's good. I want to go and see if I can find out what's going on with that battery, if we can make our way past the orbs. If we can do that, then we can do that thing and figure out if we can get into the lab or not. That would be good. So, let's go see what we can find. Hopefully, we can figure out what to do with that battery. And then we can figure out if there's a way to get into that base. Because that's kind of really super duper important. Okay, the battery's sparking right over there that way. Let's go see if we can sneak over there somehow. I 
I'm hoping. S Don't know what that sound is. I heard that sound before, and I just don't know exactly what it is. Hoping it's not like a super bad creature or anything, but it could be. And maybe it's just something we just don't know about yet. Plus, we have not made it all the way up into those trees. And that's something we probably ought to work on as well. Okay. Let's go see what we can do here, huh? If anything. Not too sure that we can do anything. I don't know where those guys are going to, huh? So I wonder if we come down over here without just, you know, getting too much attention on ourselves. Well, there's something right up there, too. There's a base up there. How do we get up there? And more importantly, can we get inside of the space here and find some more stuff? I don't know. Said I really do not want to draw attention to myself because you know how it goes. Ah, he's over there. It's right up there on the hill. All right, let's go this way. We need to get up there. That's all I can tell you. We got to figure out a way. Oh, look at the zip line. Okay. Well. Let's find a way. Maybe try to figure out how to get up in that tree. And we're going to have to go around this way. That's all there is to it. We just don't have any way to get around there. So I'm going to go see if I can do that. So if there's a way we can get up in there. Maybe we can figure a way around here and try to get over to that base. That might have some answers for us. I don't know. I just really don't know. And I don't know how we're going to get up there either. Okay. So we can't get up this way. Of that I was fairly certain to begin with. So we have to figure out a way that way. Maybe we can do it from this side, huh? If we can keep those guys from noticing us or keep away from them enough. Uh-oh. Orby. Let's go up here. Yeah, I don't think we can get up there. And I don't know how we're going to make our way past there. Well, let's go see if we can get up there, huh? Okay, we can't get up there. So 
So it's got to be something around here that we use to get up there. What? I don't know. There's got to be a way for us to get up there. There's a zip line right there. I have another Orby right there. Looks like there may be another one right over there. Okay. There's got to be a way for us to get up there. Lots of zip line there. It's just figuring out how to get across there. Now, how we use a zip line, I don't know. I've never used it before. So, that's a new thing. Maybe. So, there's a box up there that we were talking about. It looks like there's something there we can get across. I wonder. I don't know if we can use this electrical cable to get up there or not. I doubt it. Because that's just way too steep for us. Okay. Alright, this one doesn't go anywhere. But if we can get up on there and follow that around okay i think i know how to do this but it's going to take some time i want to go fill up my canteen so i'm going to work on that for a quick minute i might even go see about busting up those cookies if i can pretty soon too and then we're going to try to get up on there and travel around there now we got to figure out how to do the zip line thing and that is going to be a concern let me get the water stuff done and I'll come back and we'll try that out. There are some bugs here that I have never seen before. I don't know what they are. So let's go find out, huh? Fireflies! Okay, I've never seen them without the glow. to them that is cool now I know okay I had just never really seen what they look like in the daytime so that's really cool now we have enough stuff that we can make a headline how do you like that what time is it it's 19:30. well wow, it's already gonna be dark again Barely got started. I guess I'll have to plan on going up on that tree tomorrow. It took a long time to get my water and food up. But we did get a few more of those. And we got, oh, wow, we got a lot of that. And I'm trying to make a torch right now. So, what does the repair tool take? Okay. So I need one sap, two ropes. Um... Hoping I can make that kind of stuff real quick. Because we're going to need a 
torch up on the high place anyway. But at least I ouch. At least I am getting there, so that is good. So I'm gonna work on that, make a torch, get more food and water in the morning, and then again we will head back out and figure out if we can get to the top part there and get some stuff done, because that would be for the best. Okay. Now we're starting to make a little bit of progress, I, I think. I hope. Better be making progress. I will see you again in the morning. All right, good morning. I have been working through the night and got a late night sleep, so I woke up a little late in the morning, and I made a workbench over here, too. I figured we might as well just go ahead and use that, mainly because there's something that I wanted to make, and that thing is this butter, the Firefly Headlamp. Four iridescent, five bioluminescent goop, and three berry leather. Now, I've been making quite a bit of berry leather. I do have a bit of it in here. I have ten here. So let's take this, and then we will take those, and we're going to go make a headlamp. And it's going to be as good as a helmet for the ladybug, and that's always good. All right. Well, let's go ahead and craft this. Now we have that. Sweet. Now we can go to our inventory and we can wear this bad boy, huh? How do you like that? Sweet. Nice. So now we have light. We can see what we're doing. We can see what we're doing. That's so cool. Now we have some good light to work with and that's going to help us out quite a lot. Let's just go ahead and drop that guy in there. We're getting low on iridescent scales. But if we have this, then at least we can know, we can see where we're going and what we're doing, and that's always good. All right. Well, I am thinking, now that it's morning, of course, I gotta get food, because I always need food, it would seem like. Do that. Get some more water droplets, and we're gonna head up in that tree, and we're gonna start figuring out if we can find our way over to that other base and figure out what the heck is up there. I just don't know how we're going to get up there. That's going to be the, one of the biggest hurdles that we're facing right now. And we won't have to worry about making torches as long as we have this. So that's always good. Let me get the water. And one thing I found out too, if the water drops on this ground for whatever reason, it tends to not uh, go into, you know, roll into whatever and it just disappears. And that's not the best ever. So you got to watch out for that. I'm going to do this and press E. Okay, got that. Now I have four in here, and I want to go find at least two more drops to drink. And then we will be heading up that way and getting that stuff at least researched and hopefully be able to make some progress. That would be awesome. All right, I do believe we're about as ready as we're going to be. Provided that we don't, you know, come across any things we don't want to be facing right now. I gotta get up on the twiggy. There you go. Okay. And up we go. This is going to be the dangerous part. Hopefully, we'll be able to get across here okay. How we get up there, I don't know. Um, shoot, I didn't think this through very well. How? Okay, we just got to follow these branches, I guess. Okay, there we go. That's better. We'll follow this branch over here. Good. We're getting closer. 
Now, was that branch... Okay. Ap ap apricot Puncho. Okay, found a new mutation. Looks like we can get up over here. So, wait, now we're playing with... Whoa, whoa, no, no, don't, don't fall. Okay, it's a long ways down. As long as we knock them down off of here, I'm not too worried about them. We can always use more of the webs, that's for sure, but we gotta make a spinnerator thing too. Good. Got that. Sweet. Aha. Oh, hey, look. A juice drop you later. Yes. All right. How the heck do we ride this thing? Ah, zip line. Well. We don't have a lot of choice. We need to go figure out. Ready? <laughs> so wait. <laughs> now that was fun. Where are you going to, buddy? I got it. Well, we gotta find our arrows, man. Where's our arrows? There's our arrows. I think you may have lost one, but that's okay. 76, we sure did. Okay. Where is that base at? Aha, uh -huh, over there. Whoa. Scary up here, you know that? Long ways up. I see, we're gonna have to probably go around this way to get up there, okay. Because I really don't wanna fall off of here because that's gonna be really bad if we do. And then we gotta keep on following this around somehow. This is scary up here. I do gotta say that's a long ways down, and uh, I'm not fond of heights either. Hopefully we can make it past this stuff okay, because I just don't know. What about this way? Another zip line over there, all right. Well, it looks like we got to go down this way then. This is interesting. I do got to say, very interesting. Hoping we don't run across any enemies up here, you know what I mean? Looks like we're getting close to there, but I don't know how we're going to get... Okay, looks like we can get right on he here. Okay, um. Okay. <laughs> Aha! Mm -hmm. We made it inside a lab. How do you like that? Good. Now, there's all kinds of sound. 
Oh, dew drops. Nice. Okay, good. There's dew drops in here that we can use. Okay. Wish we could turn off the light, but we can't. Take off the helmet is about all we're going to be able to do. What's that? Oh, it's a scab. Bug juice. Sweet. We just got a scab. We just got a scab. Ooh. Ooh, green granola bars. Okay, nice. Got a little bit of food here, I guess. That's not bad. As far as I know, we can't do anything else in here. Doesn't look like it, huh? What's that? Ooh, hey, look. Did you trifle with our dwindling supply of scabs? We had at least a dozen left after that pack of spiders ab absconded with the bulk of them, and now they're not but six. I'm sure you've been busy improving them, your ever-important flavor schemes, but please return them. Okay. That was for Burgle. All right. Oh, look, a parachute. What if that's up here for a reason, huh? Now, we should probably put that on our bar. I think we're going to put that on number seven. Just in case we have to get down off of here in a hurry, you know. And... There was also another way down, or so I thought. Yep, right there. Look at that. Well, let's get rid of this. Okay. Then we can go over to there. Don't know what's over there. Ready? Wee Flingman flying disc. Okay. Well, we know there is a frisbee up here. What we know about the frisbee remains to be seen. Oh, there's all kinds of. Little dudes on there. All right. Let's go up this way. Oh, look, science. Can we get to that science very easy? I'm not sure. More science maybe over that way. It looks like we may be able to get to that science if we get down on here and we go over that way. Okay. First, we got to deal with some friends here. Okay, let's get rid of him. Oh man, that went an arrow. You're a pain. Please don't go rolling off. I got it. Losing all of our arrows, man. Oh, raw science. I hear some more. Okay. Uh, we need to go up there and get that raw science first. So let's go this way and let's get that. All right. So we lost a couple of arrows. Guess that happens, I guess. Ooh, this is dangerous up here. Ooh, I don't like that. That looks bad. Very bad. That makes me nervous. 
Okay. It looks like there's a way over here as well. Oh, look at that. Science right down there. I knew I heard some more. I just didn't know where it was at. I got it. Now we got that. Let's go back up here. And it looks like we have one more zip line to get to over there. This is the best ever! No, I agree. Sweet. Okay, good. All right, what are those fiber bandages? I guess we can always use those, huh? All right, ooh. Let us go see if there's anything we can do in here. Okay, no notes. No, nothing to gather. We cannot get back out that way. We are just stuck up here, and I don't know if we get in there or not. Sweet, we're finally making some good progress on these labs, huh? Okay, I don't believe we can get anywhere past there. All right. Now, what I want to know is... Oh, we're up on the wall. We're right by the wall, the brick wall. Okay, that's good to know. I don't know if we can get over to that brick wall, however. I wonder, can we go this way and get up on that brick wall, huh? Psych. Okay. Another dandelion tuft, and I don't think they stack terribly well. Nope, I guess they do stack. All right, well, let's go up here. And let's go see. Oops. Reset my timer here, and let's go see if... Oh, look at that. What the? How in the heck do we get those? Is there a way for us to get over there? I don't know. I'm afraid to get on these leaves that like will fall down or something. But man, that's fascinating. And it does look like there are pieces down there that maybe we can get to, huh? So it looks like it's inside of there. And however we get there, all right. Well, you know what? Let's get out number seven. And I guess we just, I don't know how we fall. I have no idea. Um, let's put you down. Left shift, okay. Go forward. Sweet, we just had a parachute ride. We just had a parachute ride. Okay, uh, we got problems. Houston, we have problems. Looks like we have all kinds of things around here to deal with, and I'm not too sure how we're going to be able to do that, but at least we are up on the brick wall now. 
It looks like there's more molars to deal with. Okay, so this is going to be definitely an adventure. Well, I think what we're going to do... Hydration is the key to performance. Well, I can have a slurp. What time is it? It is 1900. And I am probably just going to wait out the night here. And we will continue exploring this next time. We are up on the wall at least. So now we do know we can get up here. It's however we get into areas like that that I'm totally unsure about. But at least if we are here, then we know that we can, right? That's my whole thought. If we can get up here, then we know that we can be okay. So, this is Grounded. Thank you for taking the time to join me here. It's good to have you here. And it looks like there's purple stuff over this way somewhere too. Could just be a light. But I guess, yeah, it's just a light somewhere way over that way. And I don't really want to get off here yet. We're definitely going to have to do some major looking around here and finding out what the heck we can do to explore this area. All right, we just found some more area. We just found some more area. All right. Well, thank you for joining me here. Hope you had fun. This was a blast. I really enjoyed it. We found some new stuff. We made our way to a really high place. We are now doing better than I think we've ever done. And we might be able to set up a place up here too. A little hut for us or something like that. Get ourselves another little base and be able to explore this area up here. And this sounds like a lot of fun. Alright. In the meantime, we will talk to you later. You have a great day. And we will talk to you next time. Bye-bye.